All right, folks. We got a championship match, game one. All right, so we got uh, Michael and Patrick. Uh, these guys uh, play in the pro division. Um, Kaden and, and Michael obviously have, uh, they've teamed up with each other uh, various times. So, uh, <laughs> and uh, yeah, we got Jaeger again. Jaeger and Mr. Nemo to start serve. Best two out of three. Here we go. Championship match, match, cash, match, cash game. Tempe, Arizona here at Pick'em Mall. And uh, we're going to break it down. We're breaking it down live for you. Here we go. All right. Really, really good. Great drive by the uh, Jaeger there. Again, um, whoever takes his first game is really going to put the most pressure there. Um, they lost to Patrick and Michael. Um, they lost to them in the earlier rounds in pool play. But uh, Kaden and Jaeger are really figuring out their each other's game. It's a good put away lean in there backhand side by, by Michael there. We got Patrick over here, really high level tennis background. So Michael on that side, really good. And that lean in, um, Jordan is right there leaning in. And the biggest key thing when you're attacking from below the net, just being ready for that counter. And that's just, just a really good clean up volley there. Okay, we're gonna see how much slow games we're gonna see here. Really, really good. Nice attack there by Patrick. Um, Michael's there ready um, at the forehand or with the forehand in the middle. Yeah. Really good return there. And Jaeger with that top spin, deep, deep pressure on that return allows Caden to come in on his fourth and really be aggressive there. We're seeing more top spin returns in this game. That's that stretch. Again, that low dipper drop allows that kind of play. Jaeger's backhand obviously stretching uh, on the stretch, really being aggressive there with his backhand. But again, that really allows um, your partner to come over and poach because that ball is dipping down. Again, that, that is why that top spin drop is so effective here at higher levels. Good reset there. Great D. Couldn't quite get that one, but uh, you notice that first dig, uh, two hands uh, on that backhand side. Really good first dig there. Great shot over there on that side. Great topspin drop there, huh? Good. Good middle dink, I like it. Forcing that half volley. I like the move. Again, Patrick saw that. He kept that ball just low enough and just inside that sideline to kind of hinder that Ernie attempt there. Little unlucky there. Little unlucky, little break there for a team. Briona's pick a ball. Um, but here we go. This is going to be a really good game. All right, so. Patrick coming from a tennis background, super big drives, super big serves. Great, great fifth shot. A reset attempt there. Net got Caden a little bit there. But uh, yeah, Jaeger's got a good drive. We got Caden crashing in. It's a good combination to have. Oh. Really, really good. Way to be ready on that counter there. Just out. I like that roll. That's one of the shots at the higher levels that you're gonna wanna develop, a little top spin dink roll. Again, Patrick just missed it by a little bit. Maybe just moving his targets inside that sideline a little bit. Oh, a little shake and bake action. He got that topspin drop. Michael Lloyd coming across the net. Just couldn't convert. I like the aggression. I like the moves. Really, really. 
really good. Good pressure by Caden. That's one of Caden's strengths. Again, if you ever watch him play, um, just crashing the net, being a presence there. That ball is definitely out there. Sometimes it's tough to let it go. Really nice. Again, Jaeger's backhand is really strong, but again, you give him any net high ball or something like that, he has that good, uh, he's got really good form, that topspin on that forehand. Great ball. Um, okay, good put away. Pretty good put away there by Michael Lloyd. Good smash there. Uh, Michael Lloyd and um, Caden are good friends actually. Good. That's just a good solid uh, volley, fourth shot. Again, keeping, pushing Caden back. Just qu couldn't quite convert on that fifth shot. Fifth shot drop. A little mistake there. I think Mike, Michael was going for a little bit of a roll there. Just, just a little off there, a little miss it. Great ball. Again, just low enough. Those are really, just really great gets there. My Michael digging out those balls, letting that ball drop, uh, forcing Caden to really hit that low contact on that shot. Good roll there. Shout out to that power air that Caden's using right there. We got Jordan Yeager with the Ruby. Good fifth shot reset. Seventh shot. Almost seventh shot reset. What is the score here? We're gonna listen in. Six two. Ooh, we got a we got a nice lead here. I like that take. Again, anything kind of like in that waist level, if you're crashing in, someone with his mechanics, I have nothing wrong with being really aggressive on that ball. Just missed it. Great drop there. Look at that ball. Again, really nice reset middle dink. You can see Caden there out wide. Anytime you're stretched out here, resetting dink in middle is the, play, is the right play. Again, right to his strength. So when I first met Jordan, I didn't know that was his best shot. But again, if I'm driving against Jordan, I'm probably gonna drive it to the forehand side or keep it away from his backhand because that's such a strength, uh, strength for him. All right, so a little adventurous on that two-handed drive. That was just a great return by Patrick. Okay, so um, I think Michael Lloyd and Patrick feeling a little bit of pressure here. Um, these guys, I mean, Caden and Jordan are I mean, playing some high-level ball here. Yeah, so again, um, attacking below the net, we talked about that. You have to hit a good location. If you're at well below the net and you're flicking it up like that, that counter is going to come back hard. So you got to make sure you hit a, a good spot. Really good third shot drop there by Patrick, by PK there. Again, notice how that third shot drop is landing really close to that non volley zone line, forcing that really tough half volley. Here we go. We're going to see if uh, Michael and Patrick can make a little run here. Wow, wow. That was actually a good spot. I actually don't know if that ball was actually going in, but Michael has some really good drives. That was just a good get there by Jaeger there. Good. Again, great spot. Good spot leaning in there. Kaden, I would like to see him split step in transition. Great reset. Oh. Threading the needle. That's just a great shot there by Patrick. That location there, perfect, right at the feet. Um, just good roll, great technique there. That's that shot, Jaeger's favorite shot. Again, you can see that Caden coming in after that return. You can see Jaeger there really leaning in on that, covering Caden on the way up. And I think that that's super huge. If you're if your partner is on their way in on their return, really squeezing middle, trying to help them out on that fourth shot is big. Great drop. Good. 
Good patience here. This is what we like to see. Really, really good. Really good flick there by Jaeger. I mean, I'll tell you what, guys. Jaeger is stepping it up. He is stepping it up here. And just as I said that here, of course, that's the curse. That's that commentator curse there. Here we go. Forcing the half volley. Again, I like that attack there by Caden. Um, really, really good, but topspin. Jaeger has some really, he's hitting his topspin drops. He's feeling it, feeling good. Let's see if they could get a quick side out. Again, a little missed return. Here we go, score. 4-8. Good deep slice return there by Caden. Again, nice depth on that slice. Again, didn't sit up too high. just too high little mistake there by Michael Lloyd just a, just a little bit of a pop-up again down the line um, but you know it happens to all of us I mean these these guys are hitting some good roll dinks keeping that pressure on let's go all right little little error there by Patrick they're feel I know they're feeling the pressure they have to be a little bit that's a good, good stress there. Good swing and volley by Michael. Just leaning in, taking the middle there. Really, really good shot. All right, so here's that's a good side out there. Great return there. Little miss, little miss shot there by Mr. Yeager. Four nine. First serve. Great volley. Good, good dink there. Nice. It's a good roll dink there by Jaeger. Went a little bit wide. Patrick, um, just really good patience there on the ATP. If you see that ball going wide, really moving your feet really well, waiting for that. Kaden almost had that defense there. Just a little long. So I like that shot by Jaeger. He had it. He saw a little bit of a gap, but overhit it. Good D and offense there by Michael and Patrick here. They're actually making a run here. 7-9 or 7-8. Yep, just a little, little lifted dink here. All right, let's see if we get a little side out here. Seven, nine, two. Okay. All right. Not the cleanest return by Caden, but it worked out. I know he wanted it a little bit deeper there. Nine, seven. Let's see if they could close out the first game here. Great drop there by Caden. Great fifth shot reset. Oh, just missed it. Yep. Jordan had it on his paddle there. Here we go. Great reset by Jordan. Great reset there. Patrick ready for that counter. Again, I don't mind the attack by Jordan there, but again, that location and just such a high ball, that counter is gonna come back really quick. That's a good shot there. Nice. All right, as I get the ball here, we're gonna just shout out to Selkirk Sport here. Again, official sponsor of Brionis Pickleball. Here we go, 7-9. I think it's 7-9 here. That's a tough drive. That drive is low. What a low drive by Patrick. You can see Caden there just with that solid volley. And when you're playing against bangers, just having that solid volley right there. That's a good ball, right on the line there. Can't hit a better shot than that. Really great ball there by Michael Lloyd. 9-7-2. Nice middle dink, I really like that. 
Good. Way to take it out of the air by Jaeger. Little roll. Here we go. Here's a money pointer. Gosh, just a just tough speed up there. Again, a little net cord. Sometimes it goes your way, sometimes it doesn't. Let's go. Let's see if they can recoup, get a quick side out here. All right, little lackadaisical point there by Michael. Little, little loss of focus there. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Now, now it's where the pressure kick, kicks in here. Little miss return. No worries. Keep it positive. Let's see. I think they're going to see if they switch. They're going to switch it up here. Oh, man. Here we go. So we got 9-9, nine, nine, game one. Okay, lucked out there. Just, just really clean returns. Again, when you're feeling that pressure, when I'm returning, I just all I'm worried, all I'm focused about is that first return. Get that first return in, then go from there. That's a nice slice return too. Okay, so just wide, nice slice return there. Um, just really, really good there. A little bit wide by Michael. Here we go. Ten nine. Good drop. Reset. Oh, just a little. So I don't mind the move. That's Caden all day. He's gonna he's gonna take control of that middle. Find find that time to poach. I don't mind it. He was just a little bit late there on the on that counter. I like to see Caden go more middle there. Again, that's the highest part of the net. Let's see if they can get a quick side out. Here we go. Everyone's feeling the pressure here. 10 all. My heart's beating here. We got a. Uh, we got 10 all. Wow. What a freaking shot, dude. Michael Lloyd. That's where that tennis uh, ground strokes come in. 11 10. What a comeback here. What a comeback here. Okay, tough game, tough break. We're gonna see what happens in the second game. But um, again, little little errors, small errors at the end. But regardless, when it's really a high level play, these margins are so slim when it comes to closing out matches. Um, and, and really, we saw some swings there. They had a great lead. Patrick and Michael closed it a tiny bit. And uh, yeah, now we're gonna hop into game two.